Hi, it's Sudhas from G's Learning. Today we are going to see reasoning. Alpha numeric sequence test. What they will give us a sequence of numbers, digits and alphabets. So in the in that sequence we are going to find the relevant answer for the given question. So the direction is 1 to 6. Study the following arrangement carefully and answer the question given below. First what what they have given us which is which of the following is the 12th to the left of 20th from the left end of the above arrangement. To know this we need to find a shortcut. So what is it is fourth from the left of 8th from the left end the one which is right to your hand is right and the one which is left side your hand is left so fourth from the left of 8th from the left end so we have to find the 8th element and from that 8th element we have to find the left of the fourth element so which is left this side is left and the 8th element from the left is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so this is the 8th element and 4th from the left of that 8th element so 4th from the left of the 8th element is 1 2 3 4 so for this R is the answer uh, in this we can see that we are moving forward and we are moving backward so what is the shortcut is if both are given in the same side if both are left so what we are going to do is we are going to subtract the both the numbers so 8 minus 4 for 8 minus 4 is what 4 so we are just going to move four elements from the left side so what is the fourth element from the left side is 1 2 3 4 so r is the fourth element from the left side same like that for the right side if both are right and they have given some number if both are right what we are going to do is we are going to subtract 8 minus 4 which is equal to what 4 and we are going to uh, see what is the fourth element from the right side that that will be the answer so first second third and fourth so seven will be the answer for the question this will be the easy trick to reduce our time if uh, if they give two different side what can we do so let's see what happened if they gave two different side here what they have given us both at different sides so this is right and this is left and here they have given both at different sides so here left and right what we are going to do for this model is we are going to add both the numbers so 8 plus 4 is what 12 same here 8 plus 4 is 12 so in which direction we want to go is what is the last they have given here they have given a left end so for this question we are we are going to find from the left end what is the 12th position so what is the 12th position is first second third fourth fifth sixth seventh eighth ninth tenth eleventh and twelfth so one is the answer for this question and for this question is the last given one is the right end so we are going to find the 12th position from the right end so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and eleven twelve so for this question i is the answer move on to the question what they were given before is here what they have given is 12 to the left of 20th from the left end of the above so both they have given us same side so which is the left side this is the right side and this is the left side and both they have given the same side so we have to subtract them so 20 minus 12 is 8 so we have to find the 8th position from the left end what is the 8th position 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 so percentage symbol is the 8th position so this is the answer 
so the next question is how many such number are there in the above arrangement each of which is immediately preceded by the constant and also immediately followed by a symbol so what we have to know for this question is what is the successor and predecessor so we already know successor is nothing but successor of s is the next element of the s so next element of the s is j the successor of j is the next element of the j next element of j is percentage then precede what is the precede or they can given for the successor they can give it followed the followed is also the next one precede means the before one the precede of the percentage symbol is j and the precede of the j is s this is what the concept we need to know so moving on to the question what they have given us how many such numbers are there in the above arrangement each of which is immediately precede so they are talking about a number a number should be precede so the before the number there should be a constant so everybody know what is a constant is uh, a e i o u is a vowel and the alphabets rather than the vowel is the constant okay then also immediately followed by a symbol and the next one should be a symbol so first we have to find where the number is and the number should be followed by a symbol so this cannot become number should be followed by a symbol e is not a symbol and number should be followed by a symbol j is not a symbol and here the number should be followed by a symbol yeah it is correct and the number should precede a constant so h is not a vowel it is a constant so this is one parcel next nine is should be followed by a symbol so it it cannot be the answer six is followed by a symbol yeah it's right but it should be preceded by a constant so j i is not a constant it is a vowel so this cannot be next three should be followed by a symbol so it cannot be the answer seven should follow a symbol yeah it's right and it should be preceded by a constant so k is a constant so only there are two pairs what what they have given for this question shall so next move on to the next question in all the numbers in the above arrangement are dropped so every number is dropped so they are going to remove all the numbers which of the following will be the 11th from the right end which is the right end this is the right end so they are asking the 11th element from the right end and we should omit every number so we cannot omit uh, only by mind we should omit we cannot write and uh, it will take long time it's a first second third and number should be omitted fourth fifth sixth number should be omitted seventh eighth number should be omitted ninth ten number should be omitted and it's a eleventh one so uh the symbol is not given here so none of this is the answer let's move on to the next question four of the following are are like in the certain way based on the position in the above arrangement and also form a group which is one that does not belong to the group so one is not belong to the group so which we have to find in which sequence the group is so one at four where is one here it's one at It's here it is plus 2 and 4 here is 4 so it is minus 4 uh, at least we should check three uh, options to find in which way they have given so the next one is 9 2 i where is 9 it's here and here it is 2 and here it is i 9 2 they have given that it's minus 2 and plus 4 format so it is in reverse format so we definitely know which one is the correct one so we we should move on to the next option w p 6 so w is here p is here so plus 2 and minus 4 format so the original format is what is is plus 2 minus 4 so definitely 9 2 i is the odd one moving on to the next question in the above arrangements 
or written in the reverse order then which of the following is the 12th from the right hand so we should not reverse it we should not write in the reverse order in the paper what we have to set our mind is if it is given as a reverse order the left is the right and right is the left what they have given the right end so this is our right end and this is our left end if we are going to reverse it the left will be the right and the right will be the left what they have asked is the 12th from the right end so we are going to find the 12th element from the left end so what here is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 and 12 so j is the answer for this if they asked 12th element from the left end means we are going to find the 12th element from the right end nothing to do with so let's move on to the next question which should come in the place of the question mark in the following on the basis of the above sequence so they are asking which should come in the place of the question mark it's like a filling the blanks so in which sequence it is it we should find the sequence so here what they have given is hash b hash b is minus 1 and r b to r here is plus four sorry plus three format the next one is y s7 why it's in the right end y s plus one and seven minus three so we have come to an idea that what is it the alternative is in the uh, left side and the next alternative is in the right side so this alternatives are in the left side sequence and these are in the right side so the answer will come in the right side the next we have to see is here uh, the last one is in the middle term of the next one and the here e is the last term and here e is in middle likewise see here 7 is in the last term and 7 is in the middle so here what is it p p is in the last term so here what should be p should be in the middle so it can be an answer and we should omit all these let let us verify because they have given uh, none of these so none of these could also be an answer so the format should be plus one and minus three so it should come from three three plus one and minus three so the format is correct so p is the answer if you like this video please subscribe it's g's learning see you in the next video bye bye